layers onto the mold with a slow curing epoxy. Uh, the room is kept cold so that it doesn't start to cure until all four layers are on. All the veneers had been pre, uh, pre cut, pre fit. And uh, as soon as this final layer goes on, they'll put the vacuum bag on and turn on the heat in the building. And, uh, and the whole thing is all put on in a, in a couple of hours. I think they're about two hours into it at this point. What they're doing is putting the vacuum bag material on. And once this is on, it's got to be sealed completely airtight around the edges, which is the next thing they'll do. And then they'll suck the vacuum and it will compress all the veneers together and compress the glue and pull everything against the mold. The mold is completely fair, so it'll fair up any little discontinuities in the different uh, veneers. It'll suck them all together so everything's completely smooth. What they're doing now is sealing the perimeter of the bag to be airtight. So they use this specialty double stick type of tape and uh, that is an airtight seal that'll go all the way around the bag and then they'll attach a special fitting and and a suction pump and they'll suck the air out from underneath the bag and then atmospheric pressure what is atmospheric pressure 15 pounds per square inch something like that will be pressing on this thing and squeezing everything together what you hear in the background is the, is the suction pump and it's sucking the air out from under the bag and uh, I don't know exactly how long it will take before all of the air is sucked out from under that bag. Now they're checking it for leaks because if any of the perimeter tape leaks, but I don't think it is because you can see now, maybe not in the video so well, but you can see how it's getting. This is Todd French and he's holding a test panel that was done to uh, make sure that their process of veneering, pulling all the four veneers and the inside fiberglass layer, uh, this is all pulled down in one bag, which is very efficient. Um, it makes sure that the inside glass layer is very strongly adhered to the, um, la the, to the coal molded wood laminate. And even the um, inside fairing uh, material, fairing putty you can call it, even that has been attached to the inside layer of fiberglass in this process. So there's absolute 100% um, adherence between all the layers.